The Hotel Terminus in Lyon, France, was the notorious headquarters of the Gestapo during World War II. It was here that Klaus Barbie, also known as the Butcher of Lyon, carried out some of his most heinous crimes. Born in Germany in 1913, Barbie joined the Nazi Party and the SS in 1935. He quickly rose through the ranks and was appointed as head of the Gestapo in Lyon in 1942. From the Hotel Terminus, Barbie oversaw the torture and execution of thousands of French resistance fighters and Jews. Barbie was known for his brutal methods, earning him the nickname the Butcher of Lyon. After the war, Barbie fled to South America where he lived under an assumed identity. But in 1971, he was finally caught by the Bolivian authorities and extradited to France to stand trial. In absentia, Barbie had been sentenced to death in France for war crimes. However, by the time he was caught, the statute of limitation had run out on those charges. Instead, Barbie was charged with crimes against humanity, of which there is no statute of limitations, and sentenced to life in prison. But what is perhaps most shocking is the fact that after the war, Barbie worked for the U.S. Army Intelligence under the name Klaus Altman. It is still unclear how he was able to evade justice for so long and secure such a position. But one thing is certain, Klaus Barbie will be forever remembered as one of the most notorious and cruel war criminals of the 20th century. This has been Forgotten Infamy Third Reich series, telling the stories of little known and forgotten Nazi war criminals. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more.